Hello guys, welcome to Communication G. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to upgrade the SSD storage on your HP laptop. The laptop you're using today is a HP Elite with 1030G2. This laptop uses an M2 SSD drive. Let's check out our available storage on the current SSD drive. Currently, we have a latest storage available. This is a 512 gig SSD. Let's check out the storage at Tax Manager. As you can see guys, this is a 512 gig SSD drive. So we'll be upgrading our memory today with a 2TB SSD drive. So first, let's shut down the laptop. Now our laptop is fully shut down. When you look at the back of the laptop, it has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 screws. So we'll be using these two to unscrew all the screws first. One is out. We'll go to the second one. The third one. The fourth one and the fifth one. This is a very easy process. So now let's open the back cover of the laptop. This laptop has an onboard RAM, but you can upgrade the SSD storage. The tool for the SSD is slightly different, so now we have to change our screwdriver. We're using this tool to bring out the SSD. So now our screw is out. Please take a look at the SSD before you upgrade it. It has only one cut. The SSD drive with two cuts doesn't fit on this laptop. So you have to get the one with only one cut. Now let's unbox our new SSD drive. As you can see guys, these two drives are very identical. This is a 2 terabyte, and this is a 512 gig. They have the same cutout, so our new drive will fit perfectly. So let's insert it. So you push it in until the screwdriver hole is open. Then let's insert our screwdriver back. Also, the first procedure after upgrading your hard drive is to install the Windows on it. Our hard drive came with the Windows already, so we'll skip that step. Let me give you guys a closer look of the motherboard. Over here, we have the fan, we have the battery. The RAM is on board, meaning you can't upgrade it. So we are done. To insert the back cover, the down part has to go in first. Before you start screwing, make sure all the surfaces are flat. So now we can add our screws back. The screws are all of the same size. So you can insert any screw at any location. Here, one. If you remember guys, we unscrewed 5 screws, so make sure none of the screws are missing. 
to three. Four. And the last one, five. So now let's check around the laptop again. As you can see, it's perfectly smooth. Now let's turn on the laptop. Our laptop is on. So we have to skip this. You go to exit. As I said earlier, make sure you have a Windows installed on your hard drive before. So first, let's go check out the available storage. We'll go to Tax Manager. We'll go to the disk. Over here, we have 1.9 TB available. Over here, you can see SSD. That's a solid state drive. We we'll also go to Fly Explorer to check out the available storage. Wow, now we have a lot of storage available. We have 1.81 TV available. That's really nice. Thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe to our channel for more exciting videos like this. And turn on the notification. See you guys in the next video. Bye.